I'm going to record this in a different order than I'm probably going to upload it in because um, I kind of forgot to go over something. I forgot that when you first install graphic scale, it's a mess. So I want to talk a little, very briefly, I'm going to try and keep this video really short and subsequent videos shorter than I have been. Um, I want to talk about layout of graphic scale. When you first load graphic scale, like after first installing it, if my experience is any opinion, unless they've changed it, which they might have, you're just going to have like this mess of windows. Now, as you see, my layout is really arranged. The cool thing about graphic scale, sorry, cool thing about graphic scale number 389, you can move pretty much anything. So, how I have it set up is just what I prefer for efficiency. There is no right way, but this is not all there is. If you look here, there's actually a bunch of things that you can choose to not or to use. Um, so I just want to talk very briefly about what you will need and what you won't. And if you are an astute viewer, you probably already know the answer because you can just look at what I've checked, but I'll go over it nonetheless. Frame, you don't need unless you buy the full version of graphic scale, in which case you're probably already familiar enough with it. The reason you don't need frame otherwise, or at least not usually, is because that's only for animated files. And there are only two types of image files the graphic scale can work with that hold frames. Um, and that is GIFs, of course, because that's usually what animated files are. And the other is just Gale's personal file type, which is .gal. Um, and you can save frames in that, but pretty much nothing but Gale can read those, so there's not much point in using them. Uh, so in short, oh, the reason you uh, want to have it with the full version is because the trial version of graphic scale can't process GIFs, can't open or save as them. If you're really clever, you might be able to find a way to convert from .gal to .gif, but I've found that iffy at best. So um, probably don't need to worry about frame. Layer, very useful. I'll show you why coming up soon. Palette, extremely useful. Preview, take your leave it, personal preference. I like it. That's the thumbnail thing up here. Um, toolbars, tool frame. You know, I have the frame toolbar up here still just because it's not really in the way. Um, but you don't really need that. Anything else, the other things you probably do need. Short video, that's wrap. Watch it be like 20 minutes and I'll be like, what? No, it's not. Okay, goodbye.